Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Cameron, and welcome back to another video. Today, I have another episode of Creating Chelsea for you guys. Anyway, as always, we do go ahead and start off the episode with a game. Now, this guy here, he has basically no one. He has Malumbu, I think that is, in centre mid for West Brom there. But yeah, anyway, this guy here, he could have made his team have a lot more chemistry than what it did just by moving the French players over. So I don't know why he didn't do that. But yeah, anyway, this guy, as you can imagine, he wasn't very good. And look. Oh my god, look, I, I felt sorry for this guy there. Like, Drogba, while I was shooting from there, I don't quite know, but a goalkeeper, look, I'll show you a replay of it, but like, what was he doing? Like, it is just stupid. This game doesn't make sense sometimes. But anyway, Drogba and the goalkeeper, oh my god, it's. I felt sorry for him. That's like a proper FIFA fair. But anyway, we whip a ball in with here. Drogba, lovely header from him there, and unfortunately, we don't get a goal. But anyway, Izzy J Brown here. This is this is lovely. Look, he chips it over defender there. He chips it over him. I don't know why. But yeah, if anyway goes and goes a, gets a second for the game. Well, I think the, the chip over the player was just so cheeky. Like I didn't even know he could do that. But yeah, anyway, unfortunately, we do go and give away a penalty here. I wasn't even controlling the guy who was um who gave away the penalty. Yeah, so I don't really know what happened there. To be quite honest, you know, it's quite annoying. But anyway, check. I do try to put him off, and at the moment, I was getting distracted by my sister. So, you know, I kind of, I guess I have some, I don't know, kind of excuse. But anyway, we do come back here. Baker here, that was lovely dribbling from him there. He, like, evades the tackles there. Nice tackle, with a nice um, dribbling. But, you know, Drogba steps up, and Drogba goes and gets the goal. Of course, I have to go bottom left. Like, every single penalty I take with Drogba, it is going to be bottom left. So yeah, anyway, if you guys come up against me, you know you're gonna wet, you know where I'm gonna go with Drogba. But anyway, he also got a red card there. But anyway, nice ball in here from Drogba. Ruben Loftus cheeks chests it, and then he goes and gets the volley there. Like that, nah. Like this Chelsea team is playing so nicely at the moment, especially against like the really bad players. But anyway, Drogba here gets the ball, and he goes and gets a fifth for the game. This game was pretty much over now, but you know, I just had to go and get another goal. I felt like it would just be good. But anyway, this goal, this is such a nice goal. Christensen as well. A 58 rated centre back does this. Like, guaranteed this guy wasn't good, but still, like, that was a pretty nice goal there from him there. So, yeah, anyway, off the woodwork, we do go and get an achievement there. But anyway, Izzy J. Brown gets the man of the match. Drogba goes and gets a hat trick. A few assists for Izzy J. Brown there. But yeah, overall, not much really happened in that game. We do go and get 700 coins, I believe it is, yep. And we also go and get the three points, which does confirm promotion from Division 9. Also, if we go and win this game now, we go and get the title of it. But anyway, this guy here, this is probably the best team that we've come up against so far, I believe it is. He has Welbeck, Dennis, Riziki, Jay Rodriguez, Enrique, Barta, Conco, and a few other players. But anyway, we do go 1-0 down here. I wasn't really paying attention, to be quite honest. I think it was because that 6-1 win earlier, I was like, this is going to be easy. I don't need to worry about this. But, yeah, anyway, that was such a bad mistake from me. But, yeah, anyway, we do go and get a penalty here with Izzy J. Brown. What the guy was doing, I don't quite know. But, anyway, Drogba steps up and Drogba goes the way that he just goes the way that he's meant to go. Bottom left. Goalkeeper goes the wrong way. But, anyway, nice penalty there from Drogba. Anyway, afterwards, this game, it was at this moment I said I need to start playing proper, start playing properly. But yeah, Czech, what is Czech doing there? He's an 85 rated goalkeeper. He shouldn't be parrying that out in the still like the danger zone. Like that was a stupid mistake from him there. And you know, that in the first time he makes a mistake in this match from the corner. He tries to run out and gets it, stops, like then oh my god, he he just got caught out there. You either go for it or you don't, Czech. Don't just fucking stay in the middle. And that really annoyed me. I was really annoyed at this point because I really wanted to go undefeated for at least like another season or something. I believe we could do it. And then check, he goes and makes another mistake. And I was just pissed off at this point because look, he goes and gets the ball in. Dennis, check, he dives the wrong way. Like, why is Dennis going to want to go that way? Of course he's going to want to go that way. That's what way his body is. But you know, the game finishes 4-1. I was so annoyed at this point to be quite honest because I don't think we deserve to lose that match. But you know, Drogba there getting an 8.0 rating. He only got the only goal of the game, and we do go and get 600 coins. Anyway, we do go and make a signing after this, and yeah, I know the confirmation of the loss there. Very annoyed about that. But anyway, the signing is Oscar. I believe we pick him up for about a thousand coins or something, which is ridiculously cheap for Oscar. Like an 84-rated goal player for a, like less than 
a thousand coins almost. That's absolutely mad. So anyway, you can go check them off the checklist. Also, I realised I made a few mistakes. I was putting in the downgrade, or not the downgraded, but the players when they weren't upgraded in there as well. So I've gone and removed those. Don't worry, guys. But anyway, we changed our formation. I decided to go for this formation because it only then means that we have to go and get a left back. But anyway, it does bring our chemistry down to 97, but it doesn't matter. But anyway, this guy here, this is the teams that we've been playing against. This is the teams we've been destroying. And yeah, the only decent player he has is, Co uh, what's his name, Coutinho there. But anyway, Oscar here almost gets his first goal of um, the career at creating Chelsea. But anyway, Drogba here, I reckon he'd have scored that if a defender didn't give him a little tug there. I don't know if you saw that, but the defender just put him off at the last second. But anyway, we, nice pullback there to Drogba, and he goes and gets fouled. And of course, I think Drogba goes and takes this. But yeah, anyway, I believe he gets his place. Oh no, he doesn't get his place sent off yet. But yeah, anyway, Drogba there getting the goal. He was very lucky there. I believe that came off the goalkeeper's ribs, I think it was. It was something like that. Anyway, yeah, here's another replay of it. Yeah, anyway, off the ribs of the goalkeeper. That was lucky. But anyway, we go and 90th minute here. We're winning 1-0. I decide to go and get Oscar. He doesn't much have much stamina right now. But anyway, for a moment, I thought that goal wasn't going in. And I was going to be really annoyed at Oscar there. But fortunately, it goes in for us. And that gives us the win. The 2-0 win. And the title in Division 9. Now, of course, if you know from the last time we won Division 10, we go and give ourselves a bonus reward. And that reward this time is 10,000 coins. It doubles every time we win a new league, just so we can finish this um, series by FIFA 16. So, you know, we do go and get the 10k there, which gives us approximately a 13,000 coin budget. But, you know, this gives us a lot of money to spend. Anyway, we start off by spending as Biliqueta. For the left back there, we need to get 100 chemistry. Then we go and get Cesc Fabregas just to strengthen up that midfield, as we do have a lot of bronze and silver players at the moment. We then go and get Gary Cahill, as of course the defence is pretty shaky at the moment. He was only like a uh, thousand coins out. I did get, I did struggle picking him up there. I don't know why. But anyway, the next player we go and get is Andre Schürrle. Of course, his Bundesliga card is in there at the moment, so you know it's quite hard to find him on the market. But anyway, three thousand five hundred Schürrle. That was probably the most expensive uh, signing of the series yet, I believe. But anyway, then we go and get Loic Remy for about, I think it's been 1,000, 1,100 coins. But you know, we are just making so many signings today. So if you guys don't like it and you want me to kind of do it properly or anything, or you want me to trade with these coins, but I think, first of all, we need to go get a good team. But anyway, we also go and enjoy, we also go and sign the legend, John Obi Mikel. Then we go and get another right back in Ivanovic. There is just so many signings in this episode. And we go and get another legend in John Terry. Now, of course, I'm not sure if I'm going to use John Terry. I may go and use Callas just because Terry's pace at the moment isn't very good. So, anyway, now we do go away and add these players into the team. As Piliqueta goes in there. Fabregas and all the other players. I, I just slowly kind of like fix the formation. But anyway, I also go to the 4 2 3 1 2 variation, which gives us left mids and right mids so Scherler and Willian can be on full chemistry. But anyway, guys, that is pretty much it for this episode. If you have enjoyed it, please go and leave a like. If you are new around here, go and subscribe. And if you want to kind of recommend me players on who I should buy next or what the best squad should be. You know, just comment down below. Comment down below, as you know, as I've said in previous videos, you guys don't comment enough on my videos. And I kind of, I want feedback from you guys, as after all, you are the ones who are watching this, and you're the ones who are kind of, like, enjoying this, I guess. But anyway, guys, if you have liked the video, please a like. I do have a nice day. Peace.